Well, we uh, launched the Bucktails, the Spikes Bucktails yesterday in the video and uh, we had a lot of orders come in through that video. So I spent all day uh, making Bucktails and we're shipping out some orders. So this is pretty cool. So if you haven't gotten some, go to the link below, smoochandrelease.com slash shop. My hand tied Bucktails and uh, yeah, we, uh, we got some work to do, but we're shipping out a bunch of Bucktails. And hats, we're sending out some hats too. So thank you all for the support on day one of the launch. It was pretty cool and awesome. I didn't expect so many people to purchase on day one. That was really cool. So thank you, thank you so much. All right, let's go back to bucktailing and shipping stuff out. It's our daily dose of fixing my Chevy beach truck. Here we go, we got the latch for the glove compartment, the upper glove compartment. We're gonna fix this real quick and then get back to life, but here we go. This piece right here needs to be fixed. We gotta take off the bottom piece here and replace it with that. All right, it seems like all we need is a screwdriver, which I might actually have. All right, got the screwdrivers. Gotta get under here and screw these. that broken piece. It's poor foam. Seems like it's just foam. All right, we're gonna keep that foam. So now this latch has a couple screws. All right, so there's that broken latch. We have the replacement one. We're gonna put it on in. And uh, I wanna show you guys something first. My truck was made 11-19-09, check this out. All right, here we go. We're gonna go visit Brian. Brian had surgery on his hand due to a fishing injury. So we're gonna go visit him and say hello and show him the new truck because he hasn't seen the new truck. So let's go. Let's go check out his garage, see all his fishing stuff. And I mean, let's go make sure he's all right. <clears throat> Hello. I used to have bench shades. <laughs> These are great when you smoke. I don't smoke. But you could now. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> you could take it up just because you have vent shades. Nice. So yeah, this is this is the new beach truck. Side openers, huh? Yeah. I got a, the keys are in there. I don't know. What kind of rack is that? We're here with Mills. I think it's a, a Thule rack. A Thule? It looks like it. But it's got the, the little clippies. Oh, you don't have the bars? No, I, I gotta get the bars. But yeah, we got that. And then this, it's one of these. But this one, there we go. So yeah. You didn't get the plate yet? Yeah, this is coming Tuesday. I got the original plate, but it only came up to here. Which is weird because this is the standard right here. Right. So it didn't cover that or that. So then I got the metal diamond plate one, like the Ford. So that's coming and it fits this. 
What you got here, bud? So, after one season of doing trips out to Montauk and whatnot, and finding out that um, there's an awful lot of stuff back here when I'm trying to sleep back here, and it leaves this little narrow space for me in an air mattress. So I said, well, I need to get rid of some a lot of that stuff. So I was able to build these drawers. Uh, I went on YouTube, looked at a bunch of different designs guys did, and uh, it didn't need to be fancy, it just needs to be serviceable. And this works. It's uh, it was a little costly for the wood and stuff. Um, this is this is just going to work out fantastic. So there's the other one. There's the other draw. There's my extra stuff. You know, beach slippers, hats, extra suspenders, extra gloves, extra knives. That's the extras compartment. The drawers are a bit heavy, but they slide pretty decent if you can get behind it. This one's twice as heavy because it has. Oh wow! <laughs> camping gear. There's actually one more compartment, and that's where the jack is, and jumper cables, air hose, a drill, power inverter, tow rope, some gloves, some basic camping stuff, lantern, propane, uh, fire extinguisher, DOT uh, stuff, a blanket. So, and it keeps. I used to have a trunk in here with most of this stuff in it. So this eliminated the trunk and it eliminated the big box that I keep all my extra surf stuff in. And I'm gonna cut a compartment up in that front corner for a, a car battery to power my CPAP machine when I'm sleeping. And uh, I think it's, I'm, I'm excited to, <laughs> I'm excited to get out. I wish we lived in a warmer climate where it wasn't doing this white stuff. So that's what I want to do to my truck. I want to get a draw system in it like this. That way we can pack everything in here instead of having bins and bins and bins while we try to sleep in here and whatnot when we're camping or traveling. But he's out of commission because of a fishing related injury. He <laughs> fishes too much. <laughs> well, it's not just fishing. I, I also do electrical work and I'm a carpenter. so using your hands and consistent stuff like that, you develop carpal tunnel. So I had this one done about eight years ago and it was time, I was losing all the feeling in this one. Uh, so I went Monday and they did the surgery Monday. So I'm out of commission, can't really use the hand much at all for the next three or four weeks. So uh, so I, got, I picked up my van stalls, they got service. So I have them up in my room staying warm until the spring, you know. So, so what he's basically <laughs> trying to say, is, yeah, it's 100% fishing related. <laughs> Well, that was a fun day. We got a lot of things, a lot of things done. And uh, now we're, uh, we gotta go back to church and start teaching some boys again. But that's the pond. It's doing very well, considering that it's been freezing out. I have the heater in there. I got the pump running, so the water's constantly moving and it's not freezing over. So we don't really have to worry about the uh, liner breaking. But anyway, guys, I just wanna say thank you one more time for all the bucktail orders that you guys have placed in the first couple days of the launch it's insane and uh, i just want to say thank you so much so uh, those of you who haven't go ahead smoochandrelease.com slash shop you can find those bucktails we now have black bucktails up so black head black uh, thread and black tail so it's all black for that dark night fishing on like a full moon or whatever you get that good silhouette shadow look we got blacks up now for uh, two ounces so go ahead and check that. I'll leave everything in the links in the description below. But again, I just want to say thank you so much for all the support. But all right, let's go. We got some more days of preparing for this season. Hope you guys are enjoying these vlogs and uh, getting something out of them because preparing for a fishing season is fun because there's so many fishing trips being planned. It's going to be so cool. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Stay real, smooch and release, and have some fun on the water. I'll see you next time.